welcome to Eric Blackman Music. I would love to have a Fender Jim Root signature telly, but I want a real one. In this video, I will show you how I spotted a fake one based on a real experience. A friend called me up one day and said, Hey, I just saw a Fender Jim Root signature Telecaster down at the pawn store for $499. Is it the real thing? I asked. I don't know, he said. You should go down there and check it out. So I did. I walked in and saw that it was still hanging on the pawn store wall. It looked great, but right away I knew it was a fake. Here's why. My first clue. I asked, is there a case? No case. The real Jim Root Telly comes with a very nice case. I picked up the guitar and noticed that it was very light. The Jim Root Telly has a mahogany body. No way it was this light. The bridge parts were cheap. The real Jim Root Telly has very nice string saddles. The pickups read EMGX and the logo was the wrong typeface. The real Jim Root comes with EMGs, not EMGX. Upon close inspection, I noticed that the pick guard was not cut properly. There were bad edges that looked like they had been cut with a dull saw. Fender would never put a pick guard cut this badly on a signature guitar. The fingerboard was made from cheap wood. Now the real Jim Root model has an ebony fretboard. The tuners were generic sealed back. The real Jim Root comes with nice locking tuners. The neck back plate is rectangular. The real Jim Root Telly neck heel is curved and has a back plate that matches that curve. The logo and Jim Root signature are fake. This is a reprint of Jim Root's signature, and it also says that it's made in the USA. Well, according to my research, the Jim Root Telly is made in Mexico, not the USA. This is how I was able to tell that this guitar was a stone cold fake. Hopefully, this video will help you to not be fooled by one of these. Thanks for stopping by and have a great day.